And from the mountaintops to the oceans below, the largest cruise ship ever to dock in Seattle just set sail for Alaska, but don't worry, it will be back. King 5's Jake Wittenberg got a closer look, and this thing is massive. We saw it pull in. Yeah, uh, not exactly Crazy. Cam's weekend cruise on Lake <laughs> Washington. Uh, so many of you were interested in this thing. Look at the Surface Hub here for a better look at Sky King video of the Norwegian Bliss. This thing is massive. Play the video, guys. You've got a go-kart track on the, on the top deck. You've got the water slide. It's a thousand feet long, a 900 seat theater inside. And don't forget that all glass observation deck. Perfect for viewing the glaciers in Alaska, where the ship and its 4,000 passengers will soon be headed. The Norwegian Bliss arrived yesterday, but pulled out overnight. She's considered the crown jewel of the fleet. And for Seattle, it's a cash cow. An estimated $2.5 million dumped into the local economy every time a cruise ship docks. But this thing skews the average, you can say. Here's Port of Seattle Commissioner Ryan Calkins. This ship represents a cementing of Seattle as the cruise gateway on the West Coast. We really are the premier cruise terminal on the West Coast. So it's exciting to get to be a part of that. By the way, from sea level to the top, you take an elevator 20 stories up, you guys. Isn't that crazy? It actually took $30 million in renovations to change up the pier to accommodate the ship, but commissioners say it's worth it. Another feature, by the way, this giant whale mural on the bow of the ship designed by an artist familiar with Seattle. He painted the Edgewater Inn. We spoke to him, too. My dream was that the humpback whales actually get to see themselves depicted life-size on the side of this beautiful ship, Norwegian Bliss. So I thought about that and I thought, how cool is that? What are the whales going to think when they see their own kind, you know, painted up on a ship? <laughs> so the ship is gone this morning, but it will be back on Saturday. That's when it begins its maiden voyage to Alaska from Seattle. It's just on a three day cruiser right now, probably a port call. Uh, but this is the beginning of the cruise ship season. The Bliss will be back 20 times total this season. That's huge for the local economy as well. It's so much money. Like I said, the port dumped all this money into the pier, the dock to renovate, get ready for the season. It's supposed to be the busiest yet. A mojito bar, a brew house on board, and barbecue. It just keeps and the going. elevator up just 20 saying. floors. It's I mean, that's crazy. fantastic. It is crazy. I've never done it's a cruise. I've been on two cruise ships, never actually gone anywhere. Uh, <laughs> as, but, a reporter. Yeah, as a reporter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I say we take the morning show on board. Do. Let's do it. Let's do take it. Take a show on the road. I think they've got a boat. room. Yeah. We're going to clear it with the bosses. <laughs> I'm in. <laughs> Thanks, Jake.